This is your home screen. You're going to connect your printer here. And if it doesn't show up automatically after turning your printer on, make sure your Bluetooth's on and press refresh. It should show up. So you're going to use photo editing when you don't need to size your image or when your editing slash sizing is being done outside of the app in something like Procreate. This is a simple export from a design app and an import into this one. Here I'm just playing with the brightness and contrast. Use collage when you need to size your image. So sometimes when you do bring in an image, there's going to be excess on the side right here. Make sure to cut that off using the cut tool so your measurements are accurate when you print it out. And then of course you can use collage to print multiple images of different sizes like this. Image splitting requires its own video, but as a preface, it's used when you're creating a large piece or when your piece is going to extend across multiple sheets of paper, like a back or a leg piece, for example. Image scanning allows you to take a picture of anything and turn it into a stencil in the app using these filters. Play with the brightness and contrast to your preference. And that is how you use the Ozer app in a nutshell. I will do a whole nother video on how to use the image splitting.